What are you doing way back there? Bring it in close. She, Harleen likes a close-up. Fr frame it up about here. She doesn't like it way back. Good morning. And how are you feeling today? Terrible. Where's, where's Dr. Quinzel? Br bring back Harleen. I want my doctor back. Who is this guy? Dr. Quinzel is no longer in charge of your therapy. My name... She's Dr. gone. Yes. I guess she didn't like my gift. Mm. It's hard because there aren't a whole lot of flower or candy shops. I mean, what would, what would you get a girl that has everything? Nothing. My name is Dr. Hugo Strange, and we're going to be trying to... Dr. Strange? Yeah. And I'm Professor Giggles. Look, if you don't want to use your real name, that's fine. But don't come down here and treat me like that. That is my real name. And what is yours, patient 4479? Back to square one, huh? Clean slate. All progress, just gone. You think you've been making progress, do you? Well, with her, yeah. Mm. I think by the end of our session, you will view that quite differently. I am going to be trying a very shall we say, radical approach. Shock therapy? Or, or maybe you're going to show me uh, ink drawings and I can laugh at all the dirty pictures. I understand you've been having dreams lately. Dreams that coincide with your violent behavior. Let us talk about those. Well, which one would you like to hear? I go bear hunting in one of them. No, thank you. I've seen the video session already. Well, then why don't we call it a day? You, know, you can go back to whatever rock you crawl. I am a strong advocate of hypnotherapy and its incredible power over the unconscious mind. How radical are we talking? <laughs> I'm not sure I'm comfortable with this. It will not hurt. We are merely observing your brain wave activity. Are we ready to begin? If this works, and I wake up and my pants are off. A subject under hypnosis will only do what he would normally be willing to do in a conscious state. All right, like I said, if this works and I wake up and my pants are off, I want you to close your eyes and relax completely. Clear your thoughts. I want you to picture in your mind a place of safety. It is quiet, serene, and peaceful. There is no danger there. No one there to disturb you. Only stillness. Breathe in deeply. Open your eyes. Describe this place to me. I feel... Comfortable here. I like I'm on waves. It reminds me of the ocean. Are you on a ship? A raft? No, it's not a boat. I'm on a water bed. Uh, are you in a bedroom? That's a good question. Another good question is, why am I not wearing pants? Uh, we will move on from there. Are you in a house? Your apartment? That's not my house. 
but it feels like home. It's strange. I've never felt this safe before. That is good. You are safe here. Tell me your earliest memory. I'm not alone. There's a beautiful girl here with me. Why don't you ask about her pants? Is this woman a girlfriend? Your wife? No. And I don't see any future in it. She's a married woman. And that bothers you? No. She'd choose me over him any day of the week. Then she sees something in you that is human, different from the others. I like spending time with her. Are you the same when you are around her? She helps me. How does she help you? There's only one thing we do. And it helps both of us. I, th I think I understand. <clears throat> uh, where did you meet this woman? Of course, all good things have to come to an end. And I'm thinking about ending it more ways than one. I may even have... Oh. Oh, no. What is going on? Shh, shh, no. Her husband's back from water. I, I can hear him downstairs. I, I gotta get out of this water bed and wear my pants. All right. I want you to count back no, from... Shh, no, there's no time for counting. These are her pants. Where, where are my pants? There they are. I, I, I can hear him on the stairs. And his wife is starting to panic. I can't stand that. Then get out of here. That's what I'm trying to do. She's just gonna help me out my window. There. Oh. Oh. I, I'm on the ground. I'm safe. You feel safe after leaving this place? I can see the house from here. It's big, two-story, red brick, with a white door. And I can even see the address. It's 2655 Deboff Avenue, near the Palisades. Uh, that, that is my home address. Oh, of course it's your home. It's your wife and her waterbed. You son of a bitch! <laughs> How do you know these things? How did you know about these things? How do you know these things? Camera!